Hey everybody, it's that time of week that I call Facts Man Wednesday. No, I don't. I call it Whip It Out Wednesday. One more time, Whip It Out Wednesday. Okay, last two videos. You guys had two underdogs. Um, both of them didn't need the points. Both went out right. Um, today, no underdog. But I think I got a play that you guys are going to like. Let's get the plugs out of the way. Let's get some of the stuff out of the way and we'll get right to it. Because we're expecting another fucking snowstorm here, and I can't take it. It's, um, this winter sucks. See, I got my coat on inside. If you look outside, it's just starting to come off the light. It's like 6.30 in the morning. Fucking day's three hours old for me. I'm up early. Sleeping's for fags. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. Any homosexuals that are listening on, uh, watching on YouTube, I didn't mean the word to say that word, the F word. You ever notice there's all these new words, the N word, the F word, the this word, that they can't say anything anymore. No matter what you say. You, you, no matter what you say, you're going to get in trouble. That's why I try to stay away from that Twitter and all that shit, because I'll get my ass in trouble, and I'm not even a racist. I mean, I like everybody. Anyway, so let's go for the third in a row to this week. Um, people have asked me, and a, a lot of people are supporting my sponsor. Uh, when you go to the forum, sportsforumpicks.com, it's where I'm calling home for now, but in three weeks, like I say, or two weeks, we're gonna have a new, we're gonna have a new home, um, same style, same, same guys, just basically getting a change of scenery. So I want you guys to come by. I'll give you more information. Also, I'm gonna be doing my contest in Vegas. How I do in Vegas contest, where somebody could win maybe a free month of my baseball card. And yeah, everybody's always asking me about baseball. They do their research and they say, "You're the guy in baseball." But yeah, I'm the fucking guy in baseball. And more than that, I'm the guy in preseason baseball because I do well with it. Open the season yesterday, uh, Phillies against the Yankees. And uh, Phillies were small dog closed. At, I bet the Phillies had even money to close at minus 50. So I, I think I have a pretty strong influence on, on my baseball selections. Take a 5-1 lead in the ninth inning. Uh, two outs, two strikes. Guy wearing the number 99 hits a fucking three-run homer. The game ends in a tie. You know it sucks when you have a baseball game that ends in a tie. It's not like a push in basketball or football. Fucking game ended in a tie. People say it's better than losing. No, it's not. It's like fucking losing. When you're up 5-1 in the ninth inning, you need three outs to go. It's like fucking losing. Same two teams are playing today. You know, I'm not going to give you the game. But I think the outcome will be uh, a little different. The outcome will be where it should have been yesterday. Just leave it at that. You guys do what the fuck you want to do. This is a basketball comp. Speaking about basketball, two things that I like. I like Saints because I'm a fucking Saint. I like jo uh, Joes because I'm a Joe. So you take Saint and Saint Joes, got a game, right? It's not the reason why I like it. Saint Joes is installed as a one and a half point favorite um, against LaSalle. <clears throat> This 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 game, I made some money with these teams this year. Here's what I do know. LaSalle's lost three straight. St. Louis, Fordham, and Rhode Island, I think it was. These aren't exactly the fucking top three teams in the conference. They struggle on the road, two and six. Um, their last 12 ATS and straight up, they're three and nine. So I look at the number, it's one and a half points. I mean, if they're not winning on the road, one and a half points is, you know, it's meaningless. It don't mean anything. So I don't. I don't like them there. St. Joe's, on the other hand, if you look at them, it's just a way of reading a game. They haven't really been playing well, but but I think I came up with this uh, this number. They have lost nine games this year by five points or less. Three games in overtime. Twelve losses they were in there in the last thirty seconds, last minute of the game. That goes a long way with me. I like that because that shows me that team is playing for for forty minutes. When they played head to head. Uh, few weeks ago or whatever, uh, LaSalle was a six-point favorite. They were actually down 27-18 at the half. Game was down with a minute to go in the game. St. Joe's up one minute or two. Um, then LaSalle went on a, like a, an 8-2 run to win by five. I think LaSalle didn't cover that spread. I mean, if you had five and a half or six, I think that's what the line was. But the thing about that game, what a lot of people aren't uh, realizing is that unless you watch it, in a 40-minute basketball game, St. Joe's had two free throw attempts. Two, two, two free throw attempts. The uh, 
LaSalle was 11 for 14 at the free throw line. That's nine points you just can't make up. St. Joe's is the better team. Maybe the hometown calls go their way tonight as a one and a half point favorite. I'm fucking uh, back in. I'm uh, back in St. Joe's to beat LaSalle. Fuck LaSalle. I'm done with them. So like I say, I liked what they played heads up. Um, I think uh, St. Joe's at home gets the job done today. So, hey, St. Joe's is in Philly, right? I thought there was a game. I was just talking about Philly, Philly and about in baseball today. They're playing today too against the Yankees. They played yesterday. Do you know they had a fucking five-one lead in the ninth inning? The guy wearing ninety-nine hit a three-run homer, ties the game. And if you're a real degenerate, that game, that baseball game, is on the MLB Network. If it's snowing, you got nothing to do. Watch the Phillies and Yankees. You know, bet who you want. If you're fanatical, you could be a fanatical fuck. I'm a fanatical fuck. I'm very fanatical. Where do I get my lines? Three, two, one. Dom Best. Why? Because that's where you're supposed to get your line, you fucking idiots. Where else are you going to get it? Well, I get it at my local newspaper. Oh, I go and get it at uh, these uh, these other fucking ham and egg places. No, go to Dom Best. Place has been there forever. You're going to get injuries. Well, you're going to get everything you need. Follow him on Twitter, at Don Best Sports. Uh, again, going back to bookmakers, see I'm drifting. People want to people want to bet the, the tournaments and they want to do this stuff. They want to do a live in-game betting. I've been giving everybody one free week of, of all my baseball and football, uh, baseball and basketball. If you open up a brand new account at, at Bookmaker, just go to the forum, sportsforumpicks.com, click on the banner, okay, click on the banner, put in the promo code FAXMAN, shoot me an email, joe at faxman.com. Give you a free week's worth of all my selections free instead of these fucking videos once or twice a week. So uh, if you do that, you'll be getting paid. You'll be with a company that's been around for fucking... They've been around longer than... Who the hell knows? I mean, they've been around forever. I didn't have I didn't have cock hairs when they got in business. And I'm old. See, gray. But yeah, I was going through puberty when I started taking bets. My dick was that big when I started taking bets. Actually, now it's that big. But that's what happens when you get old. Anyway, speaking of dick sizes, so I was talking to my wife the other day. No, I'm teasing. This is what we're doing. Uh, Friday, I'll shoot here. Wednesday, I'll... Um, next Wednesday, I'll be in Vegas. So again, I'm going to do a contest out there, but I'll be shooting live from uh, from Vegas out there. Uh, I, I think I might be doing some radio stuff out there. If I do, I'll give you guys call letters. I'm not really sure what I want to do while I'm out there. But anyway... This is the facts, man, for everybody at Sports Forum Picks, uh, Bookmaker Don Best. Have a great day. Good luck. Bet on St. Joe's and go fuck yourself.